Here's the problem. You are given two singly linked lists, and you need to find the node where they intersect. If they don't intersect, just return null. For example, suppose list A is 4, 2, 8, 4, 5, and list B is 5, 6, 1, 8, 4, 5. These two lists intersect starting at node 8. Another example. If list A is 1, 2, 3, and list B is 4, 5, 6, then there is no intersection. The most straightforward idea is to use a hash set. First, we traverse list A and put every node into the set. Then we traverse list B. And if we ever find a node that's already in the set, that's our intersection. This method is simple, but it needs extra ON space. Another approach is to use the lengths of the lists. First, we traverse both lists to get their lengths, say len A and len B. Then we compute the difference x. We let the pointer on the longer list move ahead by x steps first. After that, we move both pointers together, and the first time they meet, that's the intersection. This method doesn't use extra space, but it requires traversing the lists twice, so it feels a bit more complicated. There's also a more elegant solution, often called the two-pointer technique. We use two pointers, PA and PB, starting from the heads of list A and list B. They move forward step by step. When one pointer reaches the end of its list, it switches to the head of the other list and keeps going. This way, no matter how different the lengths are, the two pointers will eventually meet at the intersection. If there is no intersection, they will both reach null at the same time. To understand why this works, imagine three line segments, AC, BC, and CD. Here, AC is the unique part of list A, BC is the unique part of list B, and CD is the common part. Pointer PA walks AC, then CD, then BC, and ends up at C. Its total distance is AC plus CD plus BC. Pointer PB walks BC, then CD, then AC, and also ends up at C. Its total distance is BC plus CD plus AC. So both pointers travel exactly the same distance, which guarantees they meet at the intersection point C. Here's the Python implementation of this third approach. The code is very clean. We create two pointers, PA and PB. In a loop, they keep moving forward, and if either pointer reaches the end, it switches to the head of the other list. Eventually, they either meet at the intersection or both become null. Since each node is visited at most twice, the time complexity is ON, and the space complexity is O1.